30th. Okay, so ngayon titingin si Alfonso sa ating left. If a flash a picture, kung ano yung magiging interpretation niya sa picture na kanyang nakita. Panakinig ang po natin sa larawan ng Amas Cubado Festival na ginaganap sa Magallanes. Ito po ay isang celebration na ipinapakita ng mga, magal, ng mga taga Magallanes sa masaganang ani nila ng tubo na ginagawa niya ng Mas Cubado. At lagi po natin tatandaan na ang Mas Cubado ay ang pinakamasarap at matamis na pagkain na makakaya natin dito sa Pavite. Kaya lagi, lagi natin tangkilikin at angkin ang, ang tunay na produkto at at pagkain ng ng Cavite. Thank you so much. Thank you, Alfonso. At ang number na nabili niya ay number 3. So, Miss Macor, tingin tayo sa left. that we have and I do believe that we need to promote it in our whole province because festivals it just not only bring people together but it shows camaraderie unity and togetherness and also to instill in people that we should have a sense of pride and appreciation to our rich cultural heritage thank you so much Okay, the festivity is pertaining all about the Law Hitter Festival of Tansakavite. I know for a fact that there's a lot of product that I would like to let other people know, but one thing that I would like to promote aside from Sobat or product, that is the biggest product in Sobat Tansa. That is the people itself. Why? To become more empowered, more productive, more protective of wealth. Because as of now, I know that the wisdom of Kavita is not small, powerful enough. But this is festivity enough to help to be famous enough to let other people know that Tansa is the one of the new uh, that he got the festival of here in our Kavita. But one thing is for sure, tatangkilikin natin ang isang lugar dahil nakikita natin ang ganda nito. Maraming salamat po. And I believe that that is the work or the job of the reigning Reign and Antorismo 2023 or speaking up to the people around me or inspiring other people what's really happening inside of our country Philippines. And I would like to promote it by promoting by, by promoting it by using, by using the social media and just like talking or speaking in front of many people just like what exactly what I'm doing right now. Thank you. at ang iyong napili ay I pick number 16 The picture shows Pawikan Festival of Nahit Kamite Alam naman natin na ang mga Pawikan ay isa na sa endangered, endangered species sa ating bansa And sa pamamagitan ng Naik Cavite, na i-promote natin ang pag-alaga at pag-conserve sa mga pawikang ito. And I will share you three letters on how we promote this kind of festival and product. Number one is letter S. Support local businesses and local products that we have in Cavite. Number two is letter E. Encourage people 
to promote uh, sustainable tourism to reduce the waste that the Pawikan is uh, engaging or encountering. Thank and you. Letter e. General and Thank you so much. Thank you, sir. Okay, pakibuksan na at ang number na napili mo ay number one. Choco Nate de Tablea. I am happy to see that we are still seeing this in the municipality of Alfonso. It just proves that the tradition is still alive and the culture is still preserved. However, what saddens me is that the league is now being branded as the extension of NCR in terms of pollution, of population density, and of other aspects that we do not deserve. And as your tourism ambassadress, I would like to bring back the glory of Cavite by capitalizing on our national resources what Cavite is known for. I certainly believe that Cavite has Thank everything you. it has. Thank you, Senator Mariano Alvarez. Thank you. Thank you so much. Pumili ka na ng iyong lumino. At ang iyong napili ay number. Mama! Mama! I pick number 20. I love you, Mula! I love you even more. I peak flower festival of Tagaytay City. I was born in Tagaytay, but I'm now living in General Trias. You know what? This festival is only one of the many festivals here in Cavite. And this not only proved to gather people, but to share the love, the passion, and to remember that you should be proud to be Cavitenio. Other destinations may take you away from the realities you refuse to face. But Cavite is the place that brings you back to the truth in you. And I think that is something far more important than an escape. And that is what makes Cavite truly stand out. Thank you. Thank you, General Trias. Very happy. And to be number 17. Dying Festival, it is one of the product or delicacy that our province is really rich from. As we all know, this is something that our community is where they are getting funds. And we can definitely promote this by supporting our own locals. In what way? We should always remember that we should support them by following and making sure that we can preserve them until this day and into the future so that we can definitely pass this festival to the generations of our generations. Pakatatandaan po natin, lahat ng festival sa Kabiti ay mahalaga, kaya tatandaan po natin na dapat natin itong ipasa hanggang sa susunod na generasyon. Maraming maraming salamat. Thank you. We will see you. It's a big number. Number two. Ang imahe na sa ating harapan ay ang Pahimas Festival. Ay, Pahimis Festival. Bahagi ng ating kasaysayan, tradisyon. Subalit ang dahil sa pandemya ay unti-unti na nawala ng interaction na sa nasasabing kapistahan. Kaya, Siya'y nakakadurog ng aking puso na dito tayo nagtutulungan, nagkakaisa bilang isang kabitenyo. At nandito ako sa inyong harapan upang ibahagi ang aking advokasya na tribis, proteksyonan, panatilihin, at ipagmalaki. Ang aking advokasya ay magbubukas ng oportunidad para sa ating turismo at sa mamamayang kabitenyo. At naliniwa na ako na magagawa natin ito para sa mas progresibong bagong kabite. Kalokawi! Atang iyong na PDI number number six. I think Para Para Festival it is being celebrated in the city of Desmarinas in 
actually represents the metamorphosis of a city from a small barrio into a progressive city today. I believe that we must participate and have our presence in this kind of culture event because we do not know it is the best simple way for us to preserve the cultural heritage of our province. I believe that our heritage is like a fire. We have to keep that fire burning so that from generation to generation, people will see its light, feel its warmth, so that it will never be forgotten. Thank you. Thank you, Kelly. Very well, sir. This, I think the Pini ni Magallanes, I number, Number five. Well, as we have seen here in the picture, that is Sirgana Festival, and we have seen that this is one of the proof or the testament that our culture is still alive. As we have seen, Cavite City is now a city, but they still manage to preserve the culture that they have. So as an um, tourism ambassador, I believe that preserving our culture, heritage, and feast like this is very important. Because if we will nurture what we already have, then it's not a better Cavite, it is the okay, best of the best. Up. Thank you very much. Good Thank time. you, Magalianes. Okay, and then the pili ni Maragundon ay number 14. Number 14. Ang larawan ay napapakita ng Hawaiian Festival at pinagmamalaki ko na ako ay nagmula sa munisipalidad kung saan ipinapakita ang Hawaiian Festival. Ito ay pinagdidiwang tuwing September 7 bilang pagbibigay tugay sa dalawang magiging nabiyani ng Maragondon na si General Mariano and Emiliano Riego de Dios. Ang Maragondon ang kinatawan at pinakamalaking distributor ng Hawaiian sa buong NCR and province of Cavite. Mayahan ang tulad ko ito sa aking pagkatao, sa pagkatao ng bayan ko. Kawayan kahit anumang dilubyo ang pumunta, susunod at susunod lang sa'yo pero hindi mo yan magbabali. May gima ng kasagutan ko, nagmula po ito sa puso ko, sa puso ng Cavite Turismo. Salamat po. Thank you, number please. I'd like to be in the Mendes, I number. 15. Number 15. Thank you so much. In the picture, we saw Jacobina, which is originally from my municipality, Mendez Nunez. It was started in 1947, Noceda family, and it was registered for the patent trademark in the 1950s. We, Mendezeno, are doing uh, everything just to make sure that we will promote our own product. Ladies and gentlemen, as one of the SK chairperson in my beloved municipality, what I am doing to promote our product is allotting some funds in my Sangguriang Kabataan annual budget to put uh, a contest for them to showcase their talents on how we can innovate our products. And my favorite, thank you so much. Thank you so much, man. Napaka-sexy naman. Yes. Ano ang ganda yung smile? Oo. Oh. Para ikaw. Thank you. At ang napili mo ay? Ang pili lang for four. Number four. The picture shows the festival of Carmona City, which is the Sorteo Festival. Since I am an entrepreneur, I wanted to use this platform, which is the social media, to promote what Kabiti has. Because in that way, I can show to the world that we are not only rich in history, but also we are also rich in a lot of festivity here in Cavite. And I think if I will use social media to promote that. Thank you very much. Barbie. 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 Barbie.
party. Tapos pag nagsabay kami, barbecue. Yung taba na sa likod. Okay. I At the moment, why? Number six. So, nagkamali lang tayo kanina. Ang napili kanina, yung napili na yung, ah, uh, ayan. So, Valencia na na. It is very, um, we, we all know it here in Cavite, we are not a culture, history. As a reina ng turismo and as a Cavitenia, we should always promote, promote our culture and festivals and foods because, it is a part of our life. It is it is it is what we are, Kabitenyos. I'm so proud to be Kabitenyos. Kaya pinagmamalaki ko na isang Kabitenyo na may mayamang turismo. Kaya dapat tayo mga Kabitenyo maging taas noo kahit kanino. Maraming salamat po. Maraming salamat. kagaya ko ng lungganisa. Bilang isang kabitenyo, maaaring narinig nyo na po sa ibang kandidata. Ngunit ito po ang realidad. Maipopromote ko po ang lungganisa ng IMUS sa pamamagitan ng social media. We can never deny the fact that the reality is lahat ng viewers ay nagre-rely sa social media like Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. Doon po sila pumabasa ng tunay bang masarap. Kung maganda ba ang komento ng mga tao, mananatiling masarap po yun sa mga manonood. Kaya naniniwala po ako na tayo kabitenyo ay masasarap ang magkain. Salamat po. Number seven. Number seven. Tilbo in baile. Isa sa nagpapatunay na may masasarap tayong produkto tulad sa lalawigan ng baile, hindi po siya ube. Kundi gawa ito sa rice flour with condensed milk and of course, nakinayot na nyo. Ula nagpapatunay ang kasarapan ng baile is sumasalamin sa kasarapan nating mga kabite. Kung paano magmahal, kung paano magpahalaga, at kung paano magbigay ng pamamalasakit sa ating lugar. Because I always believe, ladies and gentlemen, lagi lang itatandaan, tangkiligin na ang sariling atin, huwag tayo maging dayuhan sa sarili nating bayan. Thank you so much. We're very happy. Kasi yung mga ganun talent na kanilin eh, talagang pinaghandaan. So tanong ko, ikaw ba ay chill leader? Ako, talagang magaling ka lang. Um, actually, I'm just really happy that those people that I can help me. Thank you, bukunan okay, ka na ngayon. Let's speak a little bit. At the feeling niya ay number eight. Will the photo reflect Kabutenyo Festival of GMA? That only represents that GMA, and not just GMA, but the whole entire Cavite, are very resourceful. They have a lot of products made of Cavite. They are very resourceful to make sure that they can highlight what a true Caviteño product can contribute to the world. And in that way, we can promote that Cavite is a globally competitive province and this should be recognized towards international scene. Thank you so much. Okay, 
At ang number na kanyang nabunod ay Number 80 Number 80 The picture shows din ang pangsalinas which is from Rosario Cavite Well, actually, I may not know much about um, Pinapang Salinas in Rosario Cavite, but of course, as an advocate, I am willing to learn everything. Um, as an advocate of Reina ng Turismo, I am willing to travel the whole entire Cavite to, of course, experience it myself because I myself is a victim of pananayuhan yung yung bang nakatira ako sa Cavite but I don't know anything para kong bula thank, thank you. you so much please okay, take care naman at ang napili mo ay number 90 The Sumilang Festival is a celebration in Silang Cavite that promotes people's talents towards street dancing. And I believe that as a tourism ambassador, we should utilize this towards every part of our province to utilize all of the talents that we have as individuals, as Cavitenos, because if we hone our capabilities and we showcase it to the whole Philippines, we will not just only be the historical capital of the Philippines, but we will also be the next tourism eye of the Philippines as well. Thank you.